Hi friends, welcome to Sri Sai IT Hub. In this video of Core Java Programming, we are going to discuss the following topic. String index out of bounds exception in Java program. Right, so first of all, we'll have a small revision. What is exception? Exception means runtime error. And what is runtime error? error which occurs during execution time of a program so during the execution time of a program if we give improper input or incorrect input to our program then we'll get runtime exceptions runtime errors so runtime errors are technically known as exceptions what happens when exception occurs so when exception occurs abnormal termination of the program or breakdown of the program happens so what is this abnormal termination or breakdown of the program so abnormal termination means program stops executing then and there itself it will stop executing then and there itself for example if your program is having 100 lines in line 50 you get runtime error so in line 50 only it will stop its execution remaining statements are not executed so this is what we call it as run time error exception so exception leads to abnormal termination of the program so to avoid exceptions in our program we have to perform exception handling mechanism so what is exception handling mechanism so an exception handling mechanism we have three main steps first monitor or detect the exception in our program it is done with try block step two when exception occurs accept that exception and this is done with throw keyword and then finally we have to provide the best alternate solution for that exception and it is done with catch block so try throw catch so these are the three basic mechanism of working with exception handling in any java program so when we perform exception handling mechanism there is no abnormal termination of the program so abnormal termination of the program does not happen right so now coming to string index out of bounds exception so technically every exception is an object in java program and this object is automatically created by jvm if it is a predefined exception or it is created by developer if it is a user defined exception so coming to some predefined exceptions at the top of the exception classes every exception is a class okay and its object is created in the program to perform exception handling mechanism so every exception class their super classes are throwable class and then followed by exception class okay and under this we have two categories of exceptions checked exceptions unchecked exceptions checked exceptions are compiler known exceptions try catch blocks are compulsory unchecked exceptions are compiler unknown exceptions try and catch blocks are not compulsory but if exception occurs it leads to abnormal termination of the program so hence for unchecked exceptions developer has to detect and then provide try and catch block now coming to the string index out of bound exception it is the unchecked exception okay right so this exception occurs when we try to access a string value out of its range index we get string index out of bound exception so let us try to demonstrate this with a small program string index out of bounds exception example one so let us take a comment first program to demo string index out of bounds exception okay right and then we'll take the main class with main method string index out of bounds exception example one with the 
main method. So let us save this program in our working directory. String index out of bounds example one dot Java. Right, so let us take a string here. String ss ss is equals to hello. Right, so let us try to print each character of a string using char at method available in string class. Okay, so system dot out dot println given string characters. So system dot out dot println. So ss dot char at of zero will get the first indexed character. So H E L L O. So for every character in a string will have indexes and those indexes will range from zero, one, two, three, four. So zero is H. One is E, two is L, three is L, and four is o. H E L L O. Hello. Right. So SS dot caret of zero will get the first character. Similarly, caret of one, two, three and four right so let us save this program open the command prompt go to your working directory and compile the program java c string index out of bounds exception example one dot java so no error so since it is an unchecked exception you will not get any compilation error it is a compiler unknown exception so h e l l o now try to access the string which is out of range index out of range like 5 so care at of 5 recompile and run so we are getting this exception index out of range 5 string index out of bounds exception right so let us put try here and then followed by catch string index out of bounds exception s i o p string index out of bound exception right, so here we'll print the message okay so cannot access a string out of its bound so out of the bound we cannot access the string and then we'll print one message at the last also end of the program Right. So save this, open the command prompt, recompile and run. So here instead of abnormal termination of the program, we are getting cannot access a string out of its bound. Okay. End of the program. So we'll print one more message here. We cannot access a string out of its index range. Now let us try to access a string below 0. So below 0 means minus 1, minus 2. Let us take minus 2. If you take an index minus 2, compile. Okay, okay, fine. So here we have to close the string for println method. I'd save it, recompile, and then run. So here also we are getting it as index range cannot access a string out of its index so here negative index indicates string index out of bound 
it is not a negative array size. Negative array size means when you are giving the size of an array negative, then only we will get negative array size index. But this is string index out of bounds exception. So that is what is all about string index out of bound exception in Java program guys. Thank you for watching this video. Do like, comment and share this video and also subscribe to the YouTube channel Sri Sai IT Hub. Have a nice day.